patchwork. Hey, please stop. I need your help. I'm sorry, I can't. Just one moment. I know I look monstrous. No, you don't. I'm just really busy. Making deliveries. I know. That's why I need your help. They call me Patchwork. You need to call my company if you want a delivery. I can't take on jobs from people on the street. I can pay you. No one else will help me. People scream. They scream? The children are frightened. They tell stories about me. About the freak. Really? There are plenty of androids back in the Eastern Peninsula that want to wear dermis but can't keep it in good repair. In Navalis, such a thing is seen as an abomination. Unclean. Dermis is expensive. Do you, do you ever consider just living as an android? Never. I don't feel like an android. My body feels wrong. I want to have skin, to breathe, to feel, to sweat, to touch people without them recoiling. I understand. What do you want from me? I can't leave this alleyway. They run from me. Corpsec would fine me for causing a scene. I need Dermis. I can only buy from less reputable sources. You want me to buy you black market skin cells? No way. I can pay you well. As a human, it is not even illegal for you. Only androids are forbidden from buying from unofficial vendors. I'm sorry, you need to find someone else. There is no one else. I have been like this for a week. I will not live like this. I cannot. How far do I need to go? Just two blocks over. Here is the money. You can keep half. Fine. What is his name? Greppo. He stands on the corner, a thin mustache. He is hard to miss. And what is your name? I told you. They call me Patchwork. What is your name? Pete. I would like to be called Pete. I'll do what I can, Pete. Just right over there. Ruined book, a well-thumbed copy of some ancient paperback. It has a topless man on the cover. Weird. Oh! Oh, that's so cool. It's me. Keep moving, Sec. What? I'm not Corpse Sec. <laughs> sure you ain't. I don't have anything for you. Dermis. I need it. For a friend. Oh. <laughs> this skin job found someone to come out and play? How is Batchwork Man? His name is Pete. Pete? <laughs> Who's he fooling? He's a Batchwork Man. With the wobbly jelly eyes and the flesh hanging off him like he's skin meat. What the hell is wrong with you? You know what they say about him? The patchwork man loves to see the smiles on kids' faces. That's why he wears them over his own! <laughs> oh. Just give me the dermis. <laughs> sure, sure. <laughs> Tell patchwork I said hi. That freak. Asshole. Used battery. The uranium in this battery hasn't fully degraded yet. Should yield some limbs if I sell it to a vendor. There's a lot of elevators here. There's also an item back there. How would I get back there? I 
can't believe you have to deal with that Greppo guy. Did you get the dermis? Yeah, it's just a vial with some liquid. That's right. The cells are microscopic, but they grow and renew. I'll have full human skin for a few months, at least. Then it breaks down. Can you get something more permanent? Not unless a million limbs suddenly appear in my bank account. Would you ever live as an android? Would you? I guess not. Thank you for your help. See you around, Pete. Achievement unlocked. Grow with thicker skin. <laughs> oh, Pete. One small detail, uh, a game design choice that I that they made that I really like, is there's no collision between you and people or any other like little robot thing that moves around where you walk. Zero collision. Which I mean I guess is kind of weird, but mostly it's just really good. I'm not thinking about the fact that hey I'm clipping through these people. I'm just thinking about the fact that hey I don't have to constantly like bump into everybody everywhere I walk feels very good. I think it would feel really bad if you hit people and just constantly bouncing around these walkways. I still instinctively try to avoid people, because I just expect that I'm going to collide with them. That's it. I'm going the wrong way. That thing sort of looks like a boat. Is it? Right, heading to the Merchantile District. You ready for another peek at the sky? Merchantile District.
Is this a a dealer? You from the east, lady? You're good, but no corpse sack. Got it? Joe's and stimulants. Joe's. A golden brown high with a steady come down. Everyone knows Joe's was a legal stimulant until the drug company failed to pay their kickback to Corpsec. Stimulants. Stimulating brain and muscle tissue to give you that extra boost. So these are actually fairly expensive. But, I mean, I guess I'll get one of each. Thanks. You folks from the East are good with me, but no sec. Yeah, got it. Hmm. It seems to give a buff to... I don't know, it shows an eye. Buff to sight? And this gives a buff to sight and movement. What does that actually mean? Oh, well, it's making everything distorted and weird. I just took drugs like it was nothing. Maybe not the greatest idea. Just kind of curious. God, that looks so cool. <laughs> Between the sky as it is naturally, plus the drugs distorting it further. Oh. Broken augments. These augments have been removed. Faulty, I guess. This one has hair on it. Gross! It's worth a lot of money, though. 200 limbs. I think I want to take the stimulants. Let's save those. For what? I don't know. Steel parts. You the delivery driver? Yes, I'm from Cloudpunk. Cloudpunk? All right, here's the package. Don't open it, don't ask me about it, and don't be late. And before you ask, yes, it's supposed to smell like that. Okay, thanks. Is this real meat? What did I just say? Come in, 14FC. How are you handling the Hava so far? Hello, this is 14FC. Yes, everything is totally fine. Relax, kid. You'll get the hang of it. What's giving you the most trouble? The traffic? Yeah, and how fast everyone drives. They all know exactly where they're going. You'll be that fast once you get your bearings. Faster, even. Just remember, the highways channel an induction loop through your Hava. Right. It's pretty simple. When you're on the highways, it's like the road is moving under you. You'll get a big speed boost. Use the highways to get as close to your destination as you can, and then cut off when you're close. I can only park in the bays, right? That's right. Havas aren't meant to touch the ground. The repulsors on the parking bays keep the undercarriage a few centimeters off the ground. It's not just a technical restriction. Corpsec defines the parking around the city to maximize traffic flow. I guess that's a good thing for us. And them too. Traffic jams seize up the wheels of commerce. 
If Corpsec have one priority, it's making sure business continues as usual. So I should be using the highways. Speed boost. All right. That wasn't so bad. The corners are a little scary. opposite way. I am. Uh, oops. Well, I don't know where the highway is anymore, so I'll just head straight there. <laughs> Not this building, one over. what I can offer you today. Street style hoodie jacket. Bubblegum. Mushroom banana flavor. Mushroom? The hood makes me look like an outlaw. Or a grandma. That well, was expensive, but... Heck, let's get it. Thanks. I look forward to seeing you again. Maybe I should sell some stuff. Here's what I can offer you today. Because I'm pretty sure the broken stuff, like used battery, plasteel parts, uh, maybe I could sell this to a vendor for some limbs. I'm guessing that suggestion means that's the only use for it. Don't know if I should sell memory chips or not. Yeah, if it says I can sell it to a vendor for some limbs, I'm going to assume that means it has no other use. Otherwise, I guess I won't sell it. Thanks. I look forward to seeing you again. Let's put this on. I like this one. Oh, is that what we were currently wearing? It's okay. I like this one. See if we can get some good lighting. It's hard to see anything. It's okay. I like this one. Well, they seem to like it more. It's okay. I like this one. I kind of like the original more, but if they like it more.
I have your delivery. Give it here. It says I'm to deliver to Mr. De Beer. That's my employer. Give it to me this instant. Hey, street rat, has this been tampered with? What? No. Good. Most drivers ask what's in the package. Hmm, the smell makes them curious. What's in the package? Dinner. Meat. From which animal? What a strange question. Good day. Vehicle upgrade unlocked. Red tracer. Where do I get vehicle upgrades? Here's what I can offer you today. Oh. Thanks. That's the one we've already been to. Hey, let's have some mushroom bubblegum. <laughs> Makes us faster. Fourteen FC, are you back in Midtown yet? Look, kid, we messed up. We need you to get through a CorpSec security checkpoint. Now, you've never been scanned by CorpSec. We just paid to wipe your record, so we need them to hold a clean file on you. They won't recognize me? <laughs> Not unless you've broken any other laws. Sending you a nav point now. Uh, one more thing, kid. You need to go through on foot. So don't look suspicious. Or act suspicious. And don't mention Cloudpunk. Or me. Ah, this is that place I was trying to pass through before. So that's what it is, Corp Sec Security Checkpoint. Hold up, lady. Let's see either your citizen license or your voluntary contribution. I wish you people would just call them bribes. What's that? Nothing, officer. Here's my details. Okay. I just have to create a new record for you and then... Hold, please. I'm getting a message in my earpiece. Yes, Agent Rio. No, sir. Her name is Rania. Cloudpunk? I don't think so, sir. Yes, sir. I'll ask her. Yes, sir. I'll tell you if I think she's lying. Ma'am, are you now, or have you at any time, been a part of the illicit delivery service known as Cloudpunk? Never heard of them. Hold, please. Yes, sir. She says she's never heard of them. I believe her, sir. Okay, sir, I'll let her through. And I'll... She can hear me. Hmm? Hmm? Yes. Yep. Okay, then. I'll do that. Sir, yes, sir. Okay, miss, you can go. Your details have been updated. When I scanned your ID, our server said you're a musician from the Eastern Peninsula. Want to play us some music? Maybe another time. That's right, we do have that flute. Flyer. This card says it's for an Android dating agency, but it doesn't say if it's a dating agency for Androids, uh, for humans that want to date Androids, or for Androids that want to date humans. This your boy Rory Alpha giving you a shout out from Midtown where I am with the people. Like this young lady here who is desperate to have her say on the Undernet's hottest loudcast. Could you get the microphone away from me? Oh, we have here another stuck up young woman too busy shopping and using makeup. I call it fake up because it is really lies to trick men. 
And she doesn't even have time to talk to my listeners, the Bro Brothers. <laughs> oh, God. The listeners are called the Bro Brothers. That's right. The Bro Brothers are my pack. Am I right? <laughs> and your show is about... Finally giving the bros a chance to speak out, to have their say. I don't think you want me on your show, and I sure don't want to be on it either. Now let's try to talk to someone better, bro brothers. We gotta find the real voice of the people. We need a real man on this show. Am I right? How about that corpse sec officer? He seems to be looking at you. He seems like a real man. All right, bros, we're gonna boost now. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit up that notification bell, and I, I gotta go. Dear God. <laughs> Too real. It's an item here, but it's above us. This one's like, I don't know, it's red and doesn't actually show up on the map, so I assume I can't use it, yeah. Your face looks familiar. Do you need some stems? Coolant. Pheromones. Chemical substance triggering a social response in your favor. Huh. Pretty expensive. Thanks. See you again. Soon. Wonder how I'll know when to use it. code. Interesting. Automata custom personality is ready for instantiation. Would you like to activate Camus now? Yes, please. Camus, are you there? It's you. Oh my God. It's you. How are you? Happy. What am I? Feels strange. You've been loaded into my vehicle's automata slot. Oh. Sorry, Camus. This is all I can afford right now. I was a bad dog? No, you were the best, Camus. I am just a hova now. Not as good. I know, I know. We'll get you a new body, I promise. It will just take a while. I have a new job. You don't play music anymore? I like music. Me too, Camus, but we need money. We lost the house. I had to move us to Novalis. Oh no, we hate the city. We did. Maybe it's not so bad now. I'm doing deliveries. We are doing deliveries. I am helping. Yeah, we're a team, right? I will help. I feel not so good, though. I am sleepy now. It's the automata slot in the Hova car. It's pretty limited, and the hardware runs at a lower clock cycle, so you might need to take it easy for a while. Don't understand. Your higher operating functions are multi-threaded, but that's not supported with the hardware we have. Uh... 
That means it might take you a bit longer to figure things out. But you'll get there. I'm sleepy. Okay, rest for now, Camus. I'll bring you online soon. And Camus, I missed you too. Our AI friend is a dog. I love that. Not for the team at sea. We sent someone else. We need you to. Damn it. Sorry. We need you to pick up a package from Cambria Heights. It's a residential zone. I'm sending a nav point now. Okay, on my way. Wait. 14 FC? Is there a problem? No, never mind. Good luck. Sounds like it might be dangerous. They're worried about sending a newbie like me in. Let's take the highway. lady <laughs> yeah I got it thanks you folks are there's an item over here mm -hmm. give us a little speed boost I wish water gave me a speed boost in real life Let's see how third person is for a little bit. You know what? I already don't like it. <laughs> God, that is weird too. First person is definitely the way to go for me. an item over here, too. Our guide is 
newest palette features four mats, two ultra brights, and an iridescent topper. All programmable from the new old palette console. Sold separately. Available today. What is that icon? Um. That. My home. That's our home over there, apparently. Cables, wires, printed circuit boards. Could be junk. Could contain some sliver of valuable metal. Maybe I can sell this to a vendor. Eh, I thought it'd be worth more money. 75 is not bad, though. Control, I'm at the destination and no one is here. Control, Camus, are you awake? Yes, I am awake. Excited. Want to help. Can you scan the area? Local scan. Look for ID chips on possible delivery containers. I don't know how. Wait, I know how. I think. What is box? A box is a square cube. No, what is that box? It's right there. Okay, I see it. I guess that's the package then. Why is no one here? I have bad feelings. Me too, Camus. Are we about to be chased or something? I hear noise. What noise, Camus? Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. From the package. Uh. I hear it too. I still have bad feelings. One second, Camus. Control, come in. Control, this is driver 14 FC. Come in. This is important. Driver 14 FC, this is Control. Please deliver your current package with urgency. Control, why is this package ticking? Control, what's happening there? Uh, nothing. I've been informed that you're to stop calling us about the package. Deliver it quickly. That is all. Please, no more communication until delivery. Camus, I don't know what to do. I am nervous. Why? I am nervous because you are nervous. Maybe we can throw away the tick-tock. Tick-tock, 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 tick-tock. Maybe I could dump it at the trash chute in Section 8B. That sends it into the refuse collection at the base of the city. Nothing ever comes back from there. Will Mr. Control be mad? Yes, but I get a bad feeling too, Camus. I think it will be bad either way. I want to help, but don't know what to do. I know, Camus, I know. I just have to make a call on this one. Yeah, I'm not going to be responsible for a bomb for explosives. Look, I'll deliver shady meat or whatever, but not a freaking bomb.
Drop trash. Control told me there are only two rules, and I think we already broke them both, Camus. I guess we just tell Control we lost it? I am frightened. Don't worry, we'll be fine. Maybe I won't even be fired. Really? I doubt it. Driver 14 FC, this is Control. Is there anything you want to tell me about that last job? No, nothing. All right, well, I'm just glad it went okay. For your next delivery, please proceed to the following nav point to collect a package at Life Corp Industries. You'll need to find a way up to the roof of the building. Our client didn't leave us an access code, but, um, well, you're a smart kid. You'll think of something. Control out. Huh, I guess they really don't know what happened to it. That's definitely going to bite us in the ass later. Something's going to happen. There's no way I'm just going to get away with that. Should maybe get some gas. We're a little bit low. Could have gone smoother. There's repair stations, aren't there? Yeah. These places. I wonder if they can also be a place where I could buy upgrades? Let's actually go check that out right now. Fix all damages on your vehicle? Okay, so it is damaged. And yeah, we can buy the upgrade. Red Tracer. It ionizes the Hova exhaust to produce a red chemtrail. The racers always go for red. So purely aesthetic, but... Sounds pretty cool. Ooh. Ah, so it had neon in it before, so we can switch back to that if we want. Retro Antenna. This looks like what they used in ancient times when antennas were actually needed. Purely cosmetic. Pretty cool. I was gonna say, like, what else do we have to spend our money on? But then I realized, wait a minute, our dog friend needs a new body. And we're spending it on cosmetic things for our vehicle? Ooh, that's... that feels awkward. Well, let's go get repaired again. <laughs> Just looking at those red trails.
Okay, well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far. I'm really liking it so far. And when we return, we're going to pick up another package and hope Control hasn't noticed that we threw away the last one.